Okay, in this question, a ball is thrown from the point X and follows the path X, Y, Z. A resistance is negligible. It's a very simple question. It's a simple projectile motion. It is also a given uh, a unique name. This is known as oblique projectile. Okay, and if it is like this and you kick this ball, it goes like this. This is known as horizontal projectile. Anyways. So what air is, this is a simple oblique projectile. Air resistance is negligible. So it becomes a very ideal case. Which quantity is zero when the ball is at the highest point? So when the ball is at the highest point, which quantity is zero? We must understand this thing. Like at X, the velocity is this. And so there is there are two components, the X component and the Y component. Gravity is always acting, so the acceleration is always vertical, it is never horizontal at all the points. At y, it is having only and only the x-axis velocity. There is no vertical velocity here as a characteristic of projectile motion. And definitely it is being acted upon by gravity, which is vertical. Now, the which quantity is zero when the ball is at the highest point, the horizontal component of the ball's acceleration. So horizontal component of the ball does not exist because the air resistance is negligible. So there is no drag backside. There is no force in the right direction. The gravity that is the weight is acting only and only in the vertical direction. So A option is absolutely correct. There is no horizontal component of the gravity of the acceleration. So A option is correct. What about B? The vertical component of the ball's acceleration. Not at all. The acceleration is gravity, which is vertical. Horizontal component of ball's velocity, no, it is also not zero. This is the horizontal and it cannot be zero. Kinetic energy, obviously half mv square is not zero. Even this is not zero. So E option is our answer. All the best.